Bryos YouTube, it's me again, the Shadow King King Nazaru. Now, this, uh, this update might be a little late, but I feel that I should uh, bring it up anyway. Well, what I'm talking about is another update for Dragon Ball Xenoverse. And we just got some information not too long ago, but it still feels kind of a while back. Um, what I'm referring to is that we got some information about uh, DLC for Dragon Ball Xenoverse. Uh, specifically if you pre-order the game. Uh, so if you pre-order the game, you'll get uh, three added content to it. Uh, the first two are these stylized armor uh, used for Frieza's army or the Saiyans. Uh, one is a gold variation and, and another is a crystal. And the third one well, uh, is a Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Um, now, there's probably some of you wondering why I didn't uh, talk about it sooner. And, uh, like I said, uh, there's been a lot of you know, a lot of work done on the house. And I, used, I don't get as much time to myself uh, to do these things as I should. And, uh... Yeah, and there's also some of you people thinking, um, what do I feel? How do I feel about the whole Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta being a DLC? I say the same thing I felt about GT being in Dragon Ball Universe and thing at all. I don't like it. Uh, uh, they're pretty much gonna play like the end to add in insult to injury to all the GT fans, uh, they're going to play it the same way they did that uh, Naruto costumed Goku. I just feel sick for even saying that. Yeah, they're going to do that thing and just make it first come, first serve. So if you miss the, if you miss the uh, packages without the pre-order, uh, that's like the first shipping. If you miss that shipping, you've lost the chance to get, uh, get the G, that Super Saiyan 4. It'll never happen again. You won't get it on PlayStation Network. You're, you're done. And, uh, some of you are wondering, um, where, where do I stand? Do, am I going to get it since I've already pre-ordered it? Uh, well, the answer is yes, I'm going to get the game because I pre-ordered I want to play that game as soon as possible. And the whole Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta thing will just be a finale. I do not like GT, but this is not, but I'm not going to do the same thing I did with Naruto and just, did I miss it, did I miss a day or did I just throw the, the, uh, the DLC code in the trash? Either way, I'm not going to do the exact same thing. It's just going to be a, just going to be a mere formality. Uh, whether or not I use it uh, will depend on how my mood is. At best, I'll probably just use Super Saiyan 4 to like get a head start and uh, have it sort of an advantage towards other NPCs or characters while being played by uh, other players. So yeah, that's all that is to that DLC. And I'll catch you guys later.